Okay, so last week I know I didn't post a video because the whole internet thing. But last week I wrote about living under the rock, which is my grass rock. Well, as a kid, it never really bothered me because I had three older siblings and like we kind of just would rely on each other to just have fun with each other and just like do stupid things. Well, as we got older, the three older ones kind of like how they're three years apart and then I'm five years apart from the one before me. It kind of like how there's a gap between us. They kind of moved forward and started growing up and started going out because the older one knew how to drive. So it's like I got stuck at home with my parents. So that kind of started bothering me and it's like I can't do anything about it because I'm just, I'm what, eight, nine years old in California. So then, and then in California, I, I was really, I'm still shy and like that has stuck with me like since I was a kid. I've, I wouldn't call them, I guess they're friends or people you talk to at school, but it's not like they have your number or you go see them like on the weekends or you guys hang out. I didn't have any of that in California. All I had was my four siblings and I would have to rely on them to go have fun or go out with my parents. Moving to Texas, I had friends <laughs> and like I started, they act actually brought home friends to the house because they wouldn't let me go out. I, I've been on lockdown basically my whole life. And when it comes down to like dating and all of that, it doesn't happen for me. I'm, the way I was raised, it's like, you're going to bring home the guy, the right guy for you. I've, they've only met one boyfriend out of like six that I've had, or not even, probably less. But then, when it, like, I cannot date. If I'm 18, I go to college, I'm still on lockdown. And honestly, it's starting to get to me, but if I break the rules or if I bend them a little, I'll get in trouble. And yeah, it's like you're 18, you're an adult, Evelyn, but I don't know. I, I guess it's kept me away from all of the bad stuff that people have experienced. I've experienced relationship problems, but like when it comes down to drugs and alcohol, it's like one drugs I'd rather not mess with because with the career I want, I don't want to get involved. Alcohol, it's like, yeah, it'll loosen you up and to have fun and all, but what if you overdo it? Sloppy drunk. I don't want anybody to see me at that point, so I'd rather stay away from that too. And yeah, I know I should experience it all, so then I know my kids, the things that they're doing, but it's like, you kind of, as our generation is like, going there's kids in middle school pregnant it's like you kind of know at the age where everything all starts but yeah that's basically what i wrote about and this week i know we we wrote about relationships already but i want to dedicate this one chapter to the relationship i wish i had with my mother i know people that have are able to tell their mom everything and anything and like they'll understand them and like it's like it's between them and I don't have any of that I have my sister but it's not the same it's not like if I tell her something she won't tell it's like if I mess with her and she gets mad she's gonna tell she uses that against me sometimes but I really I've always wanted that close relationship with your mom like it's something I've been wanting and trying to create as I got older, but it's, I feel like it's still the same, not as much as it used to be, but like now being 18, like kind of in school and like working, she's kind of more understanding about things, but I feel like I can't tell her anything serious without her telling my dad, which is sometimes I don't want him to know. Um... It really does bother me. I really wish we were a lot closer. But it's not something I have right now. And maybe later on in life, I'll be that child that's always there for her. So we'll see what happens. I kind of just wanted to dedicate this on that. Because sometimes.
something I've always wanted, but I can't ever get. Well, if that all made sense, that's what I wrote about in the past two weeks. Um, I'm kind of starting to run out on things to write about because I just, I don't know, my life is so simple. It's not like outgoing and out there, but for now, that's all I got. See you in class tomorrow.